New at six, mass shootings in schools have scared the country and unnerved parents and students everywhere. In the wake of the shootings in Parkland, Florida and Santa Fe, Texas, lawmakers vowed to increase funding that would help make our schools safer. That's why North Carolina Republicans have included $35 million in next year's budget that would help improve school safety in response to mass shootings. But the proposal is far less than the $130 million plan Governor Roy Cooper is asking for. NBC Charlotte's Rad Berkey talked with the governor today. Rad seems to be setting the stage for a battle over the budget. It certainly seems the stage is set for that, and with Republicans in control in both the Senate and the House, it would be a tough fight for the governor. The thing I want to do is to make sure that we have a quality teacher in every classroom and a quality principal in every school. Governor Cooper toured J.M. Alexander Middle School in Huntersville, where he spoke with teachers and went into a couple of classrooms to talk about education, teacher pay, and school safety. You guys are going to get your IB degree. The House will come back to order. Meantime, Republican legislators released their budget plans that call for spending $35 million on schools and school safety far less than the 130 million Governor Cooper is asking for. Defending the Republican proposal, Representative John Torbett from Gaston County said these investments begin the process of providing our state the necessary resources to safeguard our children's mental and physical health. It's just not enough. Cooper said Republicans don't have their priorities straight, saying they favor cutting taxes to big businesses over education. They want to make sure the corporations get the break. I say we invested in public education. I say we invested in school safety. The State Association of Educators condemned the Republican plans, saying they fall well short of the resources our students need and what Governor Cooper is recommending. Asked how he could overcome supermajorities in the House and the Senate, Governor Cooper said, remember, November is coming. In Huntersville, Radberkey, NBC Charlotte.